Hey, what's up everybody, and welcome back to yet another episode of Minecraft. So, in this episode, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you the truth. This farm is not efficient. I mean, the harvesting system isn't efficient, the rest of it is quite good. But yeah, um, we just switch out here, yeah? So, I harvested this whole side, I let it grow, yeah, I harvested the whole side, after it all grew. Um, and it's like half an hour later. Well, half an hour later in game, it's like a week later in real life for me. Uh, but yeah, um, there's still lots of items in these hoppers, even after half an hour. And I actually had to uh, get some of the items that were sitting on this hopper because I couldn't go through because it was already blocked up on into this hopper, even though this hopper shouldn't have anything on it because, um, well, because the water, there was nothing there. So, what I'm thinking is that I'm going to need to remove all of these water streams and just replace it with hoppers for this to work well. So, I'm going to go gather some iron from somewhere and I'm going to do that real quick because this is not going to be efficient if all the items despawn before they can even get there. But yeah, we do have a lot of stuff now. And this is amazing. <laughs> okay. Um, right, so... Do I have coppers in my ender chest, I wonder? Do I not have a redstone chest? I need a redstone chest. Boy, this is bad. It would be here, wouldn't it? Okay, I do have hoppers. I don't think that's enough, though. So... We can start getting rid of this. I'm gonna get my packed ice back, which is nice. Because there's not infinite an infinite amount of it. Okay. And this will most likely not be enough to do everything. But doesn't matter. There's a random block missing there. Cool. I'm gonna have to make all this uh, that nice stuff. The stone bricks because otherwise it doesn't fit in. And also I'm gonna need to uh, redo the whole collection system over here actually. So at, right now it goes to the very middle here. Um, what I'm gonna have, have it to is I'm gonna put I'm still gonna have a hopper in the middle here yeah but I'm gonna have this hopper go down as well that way actually no that won't work basically I need to split it up so that it can transfer faster that's the idea um, the best way to do that, oh you know what there's a better way of doing this all. I am a failure. Um, we need like 20 million uh, copper mine hearts, mine carts, um, and then have all of them over a chest. And that will work wonders, but you know what? I'm just gonna do one issue at a time. And then I might redo this later again. But yeah, let's say this is Functional, but not complete yet. Let's just, let's just say that about this for now. I'm missing just a few hoppers, that's annoying. And this stuff is still not going to be done by the time we finish here. Middle's here. Yeah, there's still loads to do. Well, just this hopper, I guess. But yeah, like it, it's not it's not quick. So if we just get back out, um, I'll take all the seeds and I'll replant the tool, and then I'll get the few more hoppers I need. So a full harvest pretty much fills up the whole chest. That's nice. So I'm gonna have to use all of this up, won't I? So that's annoying me. 
We're gonna have bread for days though, that's good. Uh, I think I'm gonna put all the wheat up here. Um, I'll just transfer it all because that way it's nicer. It's gonna be like a separate chest just for wheat. This is where I was gonna harvest. This chest just for wheat, and then the, this chest just for seeds. Like whilst it's being harvested, not overall. Oh no, no, this is overall, but this chest is for just harvesting. Also, I need to light up all the caves around here, like at some point, because I'm gonna build a mob system here. So I'm gonna need all the caves lit up for that. That's gonna be a lot of fun to do. Not that way, but this way. And there's uh, still a few items in that hopper, I guess. Okay, well, I can start taking the seeds and planting it all, and I'll be right back, I guess. Oh yeah, I've also done some digging here, don't know if I showed you yet. So, that's that. So, for one of those full columns, I need 8 stacks and 48. I'm just short for the final one. So I guess I'll have to do that after the next full harvest. But we do have a lot of wheat here, and we have got some bread, but I'm going to make another stack real quick anyway, because it's useful. Because that, that one right there is not going to last me very long, is it? So yeah, got food for days now. Um, we have completed the mega wheat farm that we were sent to do a long, long time ago. Um, I still got food here, that's good, okay. Don't have to worry about emergency food. So yeah, all is good. And uh, yeah, I think we're going to go do something else now. So, just going to sort my inventory out a little bit better. Yeah. Cool, I'm going to need to go get my, some more firework rockets and I'm going to... Now I'm just going to go to the end to repair a whole bunch of stuff now. So I'm going to do... For some reason, whenever I enter the nether, like, instantly I get a massive lag spike for like 10 seconds at like 2 FPS. And, like, I can't figure it out. Like, there's not much to load. Like, when I go into the overworld where there's a lot more to load, there's no lag spike, really. Um, just here to see if there's any with the skellies I can kill to get some quick skulls because I need I need more skulls I need I need some more beacons and as you saw I only have one skull which sucks however yeah there's a however um oh there's stuck in the ceiling crap oh boy oh no okay do not go there then. So yeah, um, last time last time I did this, I killed one skeleton and he gave me three skulls. So I'm not sure what that's about. Um, like I think they I think they changed it recently, some somewhat recently. Also, this boat is gonna die soon. I need to like go fix it. Oh boy, no! I hate this so much. Oh my god! Stop trying to kill me! Oh my! This is going so smoothly. I apparently need to use a sword for that, or bow. Get out of the way. There we go. That's fixed it. Oh, and there's blaze everywhere, of course. Yeah, I should really make up with a skeleton farm here now. Um, I, that's all I'm going to... That's all I'm, I'm pretty much coming here for now other than to get to the second base. Yeah, that's all I'm coming here for, apart from getting to the second base. But, yeah, it would be nice to have a Wither Skeleton Farm here. Um, 
they're pretty simple to make, they just take a whole lot of your time. Um, okay, there's the Wither Skeleton. Get some blocks ready. Okay, he's just gonna do that then. Crap. Nope, didn't get it. Gonna hide here for a bit. Hate getting withered. Alright, I'm wasting your time, guys. Alright, so I went to the end, repaired all my stuff, um, restocked all my fireworks. So all is good now, we can carry on doing normal stuff. I've also added some, and then breaking enchantment and a punch enchantment on the bow here. So this should last us a lot longer now, and it should be better. And also I've added unbreaking onto this, because it didn't for some reason. So yeah, that, that's all good now. Um, I, I want to, here's what I want to do. I want to make a massive map. Um, and... I want to make it like 20 by 20 although let's keep this real um gonna I, I, okay 16 by 9 because I want to have it to computer aspect ratio so yeah I'm gonna have a 16 by 9 map so 16 long and 9 tall um I guess I will start with this map I'll just like copy it over um so I'm gonna get a whole bunch of maps from somewhere I'm gonna copy all of these out and I'm gonna make a massive map somewhere, I don't know where. I don't know what for, but I'm gonna have a massive map and it's gonna be awesome. Um, I guess we should look for a place to put it first, I guess. Um, that would make most sense to me. And then we'll go and do stuff according to the map. So, how do you make a map even? I forgot. Oh man, I actually have to use this now. Would it be under here? No. I have to craft it first, I think. Map. No. Okay. Uh, paper. I think I need paper. Okay, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Actually, you know what, guys, I'm not going to copy that map out because I'm going to make it the biggest I can, which I think is 1 to 16. And our whole little village here is absolutely tiny compared to that one over there. Um, like, this is tiny, and I want to make a lot of this. So this is going to be a big project for sure, and I think I'll complete it today because I have Elytra. Um, so, yeah. As you can see, the whole village that we're in, yeah, is all of this right here, yeah, being shown on that tiny little dot there. Actually, no, it even stretches further than this de desert. It goes like there. That's how much we have in that one map. Nice. I still haven't figured out how to make it though. I'll, I'll, I'll get to that. Okay, so I'm about to make a stack of maps, but I just realized I don't even need that many. Um, I only need about... Okay, well... 16 by 9... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need that many. I'm gonna need a lot of maps, I think, for a 16 by 9 area. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna need way more than a stack. This is gonna be a massive map, guys. And guess why I'm doing it? I, I, I decided to make a challenge. Because some of my friends made a massive map and I was like, okay, I can do better. They had like an 8x2 map. It was ultra wide, so it was pretty cool actually. I'll, I'll give I'll give them props for that. It was pretty cool. So I'm gonna try to do better. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, crap. Um Eight, cool. Mm. 
So we have a whole bunch of maps here. Um, I'm just going to check if I can make a bigger map than this. Uh, no, you can't. Okay, that's good. Because I don't think I'll be able to make anything bigger than that. Alright, so um, here's how we're going to do it. We're going to make one map. And then we're going to use that map to look for the next place where we can make the map. or well, the next map, yeah? And then where we make that next map is going to basically... Like, after we make that map, we're going to place the first map onto our massive board. I still don't know where to put it, so... Yes. I am a genius. We're going to put it here somewhere. Um... I don't know where, but we're going to put it here somewhere. How big is this? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, no. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, damn. That was close. Um, okay, you know what? That's what our basement is going to be for. So, what we're going to do now... Um, because I don't have a basement yet, I'm gonna build this outside of the house. So I'm gonna place it on the side here, like right here. Uh, house tool is nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh my god, this is gonna be huge. One, two, three, four, five, six, no, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So that's a big map, guys. It's going to be like massive. You know, I think, yeah, I think what I'm going to do, yeah? Because this world is going to be so big once I do it, yeah? I'm going to delete this, delete most of the world in MC Edit. Like, that map is probably so big that I'm going to get to my second base. Wow. Okay. I need leather. Do I not have leather? Okay, I know where it is. I didn't even have enough wood to do this. Okay, so I got a whole bunch of paper together so that when I go out I can make the bigger maps. I made a whole bunch of item frames. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So somewhere around there is going to be our starting point. Does that look like the middle to me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. And then one, two, three, four, five. That's the middle. So that's where we're going to start. Um, that's where our house is going to be. Right in the middle. Well, the map for our house. Oh, I didn't realize it. The map doesn't render. It just shows the item. That's actually really cool. Okay, that's, that's cool. That is cool. What if I... I don't want to. I don't want to actually make. I accidentally make a map if I do something wrong. Okay, so we've got this map, yeah. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take it into our offhand, and we're gonna fly off and do this for a long, long time until the whole map is done, which is gonna take a while. Now we fly this way, and I should probably do this all off camera. Um, I'll probably get back to you if I find anything interesting. See, so yeah, I'm just gonna go around the whole map, which is gonna take a really long time. Like, a four of these maps are probably big enough for my for the whole world size that there is. But I want to make everything bigger, as always. Should have made three times firework rockets, not two. This would last me longer. Oh well, I'll get back to you. See you in a bit. Look at what I found. I might have been here already before. I know. Uh, yeah, I think I've been here before. I remember Savannah next to a mushroom island, so okay, let's get back. Never mind. Okay, this is actually a pretty cool place. Uh, there's a village over there which I'm not going to check out now because I don't have the time for it. Uh, there's a flower forest there, there and there. That's pretty cool actually. Yeah. 
carry on. Okay, so I went around the whole map once. I don't think I missed any, like, right at the edge kind of places. Uh, it doesn't look like it. Um, like, right over there, it looks like it's sand, uh, which is good because if I miss the map, I have to fly all the way back over there, which I don't want to do. So now I'm going to fill in the whole map, I think, and uh, maybe do three more and then end the episode because it's getting quite long. And also, I don't have the time... I need to record another thing now. So yeah, I'll, I'll just do that and then I'll be back to you guys. This is actually quite fun. Well, the world size is going to be huge for when I need to upload it to you guys so that you can check it out. Okay, let's figure out how I'm going to do this. This way. Cool. There's so many temples. Like, one just there like 100 blocks away well maybe a bit more than 100 but yeah like two 300 blocks away there's another one there and then one right there and then probably gonna be a few more here like we need to start clearing them out and getting some stuff from it cuz like lots of good stuff anyway the world's not loading now I'll stop recording yep another one right there and I'm just checking that this map is actually complete and not like missing a whole bunch of places. So um, that took a while and also many many rockets. Um, I think I'm going to need to uh, get my creeper farm to get enough rockets to do this whole thing. Uh, that took like half an hour to do. Wow. Um, let me sleep because I don't like rain. Oh, it doesn't show the map when it's on the offhand. That's interesting. Microsoft fix your game. I'm kidding, I'm playing in an old version. Okay, so just checking if I Oh I missed a bit. I missed a little bit. Like right there. It looks so perfect though. Okay, you can't do that. Um Crap. Because I have to go back now. That's a long way, just saying. Like, okay, so coordinates here, yeah, that's the wrong button. Coordinates here, yeah, at my base. And then, those are the coordinates here. Where the map was not working. Wait. So was that actually all fine and just looked like it wasn't? Because if so, I'm going to be really mad. I just I just spent like two minutes flying here. Like, two minutes of my life. How dare it. It's all fine. Wow. I don't know which way I'm going. I think it's that way. This way. Yeah, okay. So, oh my god, that that's actually all fine. It just looks like that on the small map. Well, big map. It looks like that small on the map. Okay, that's annoying. Uh, I guess I'll go place this in the thing, and then I'll make the next map. Okay, now I'm not sure if I want to have this on the fourth layer up or on the fifth layer up, because technically we're close to the fifth layer up there. I think we'll have it on the fifth layer. I mean fourth layer, like that. So we got that... this... little bit done. <laughs> That's uh, very little compared to what we need to do, and that took a really long time. So let's go make the next map, I guess. Um, we need to go there, and we'll be out of rockets by the time we finish. Oh my god, okay. Uh, we cannot do this now. So that one map used up pretty much my entire elytra. Um So we've got to be careful. Um, I think I'll have enough light to do the very corners, like, but just barely to get there and back. Um, I'm gonna make another elytra. Uh, well, two more actually. I'm gonna make two more elytras that I'm gonna have in my inner chest at all time. So that, uh, with mending and unbreaking, yeah. So that when I need to, I have them to, uh, use as backup. 
because really they don't have that much they don't have that much health do they um, so yeah this project <laughs> will be difficult to do um, I was just thinking to do it on like horse on a horse the whole time um, and uh, that would take like absolute forever because horses are so slow so I, what I'm thinking yeah is to do a slightly smaller version of that project same size maps yeah as soon as maps come out in my time traveler series do the exact same project on a horse in the new world that I'm gonna be in by that time in my time traveler series same same map sizes but because it's gonna be on a horse I'm gonna do ah uh, crap what was it six, six by nine yeah it's gonna be nine wide and well nine by six technically so it's gonna be nine wide and it's gonna be six tall Oh, you know what? It would be just easier if I just did an 8x8. Eight eight. Yeah, I'm just going to do an 8x8. Eight eight. Still going to be a massive map. But, you know, okay, 1 to 8 size. 1 to 8 size, not 1 to 16. Like, I don't want to kill myself. Yeah. And we could actually start working on it a bit quicker if maps do come out quite early. I don't remember when they come out. Um, but yeah, if maps come out fairly early, then we could do it with Ender Pearls first before the horses, because horses only come out in 1.6. And if maps come out before that, which I think they do, um, we can start with Ender Pearls, just like the first four maps, because I'm not going further than that with Ender Pearls. It's gonna take forever. Boy, this episode's getting long. I should probably end it soon. Okay, so I'm quickly gonna make another map um, before end the episode. So I'm gonna start right here. Um, I think that's far enough from there. I hope it is. Um, so I'm just gonna make a map. Need my paper. Map. Scaling one to one. Wait, this is this not how you do it? No, it's 1 to 2 now, okay. Yeah, I think it's next size map, so that's good. 1, one out of 4. Yeah, it's the next size map, good. 2 out of... Oh boy, this is going to be big. 1, 8. And now 1, 16. I am crazy. I know. You know I should probably put that back. I'm going to put all the maps all there now. Um, okay. Let's get going. Ooh, another mushroom island. I think it's a different one. Actually, no, that's the same ones. Never mind, sorry guys. Alright, so I've done the next map, um, you can see over here I have got the Mushroom Island, or Mushroom Island, um, somewhere around here is supposed to be a nice spiked biome, somewhere about here is supposed to be a, a mesa, mesa jungle, blah blah blah, There's, this is supposed to be a massive map, um, yeah, this is gonna, this is gonna be big, um, well, that took a while, um, I actually did something that was a bit more economic on the elytra. Instead of going in a spiral, I did this, which I don't think really made that much of an effect. No, I, di I didn't do that. I did that. Yeah. Uh, I don't think it really mattered, though. Uh, like, I, I wouldn't have guessed it would matter, but I feel like it did matter. Yeah, anyway. So that's another map done. I'm going to be working on this off camera and then maybe spend the entire next episode working on it. I don't know. I uh, hope you enjoyed the 69th episode of uh, the Minecraft series. 69 episodes already. Um, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna work on this. I'm and it may maybe in the next episode, instead of, like, if I don't feel like working on this, I'll work on the basement where to put this. And then I'll work off camera on this again. This is going to be big. It's going to be massive, guys. Yeah, 
Um, I hope you enjoyed the episode though, so thank you for watching. If you liked it, then be sure to smash that like button. If you want to see more, click subscribe. And if you don't want to miss anything out, click the notification bell. And as always, I hope you have a good day. I'll see you next one. Bye-bye.